All right, let's talk about speed storage, shall we? In this game, you can cast spells, right? So we're gonna cast one spell here. And the first thing you're gonna notice with this spell is that you're always centered with the runes. So you see Michael here is right in the middle of the runes, right? So there's a technique that we can use that is called speed storage. What most people do when they want to do a spell in the middle of a room is that they stop and make this spell. Because you have to stop, of course. Otherwise, the spell is gonna be cancelled, you know? Like, you just waste your magic there. So, what is like the best way to stop? We already talked about how you instantly stop your movement with target. When we talk about target run. One thing that the game does is that every time you target, the game actually stores your speed. So now I'm targeting. If I let down target, you see this guy move like a little bit, just a little bit. So like, okay, so like I got target there, and then we can like take a quick look at this feet, and I'm gonna let down, let go target. And you see I advance like a little bit, so the game is storing that speed that can be used to your advantage. Like the best you can do, like you can stop and then keep running at the same speed. You don't have to like start running, ever. We can use that for spells. What you want to do is you want to target as soon as you do the spell. You can like even do both at the same frame, the exact same frame. Which is kind of hard with this, uh, with the D-pad. But with Y, it's fairly easy because you just press Y and R at the same time. So just take that on account for your assignments because it's easier with Y. So we just do that. We are running and when we do a spell, we press the spell and target at the same time. So that. And now if you notice, I'm gonna let down R. I just let go R, nothing else. I didn't press the stick. And you see his position slightly off we're farther away from from before he's not on the center right so you went a little bit farther and of course if you keep running after the spell you don't lose any speed which is pretty cool now there is a downside to this because this looks pretty cool but there's a kind of a downside which is there is a risk of canceling your spell so let's take a look at that when you do a spell if you move while casting, you're gonna cancel this spell. And that this same phenomena can happen when you do speed storage, okay? So we're gonna do speed storage, like Y and R at the same time while you run. So there you go. If you let go R, you're gonna advance a little bit. And that means the thing is gonna be cancelled. So one of the risks of this is that you cannot let go R until the thing is fully completed, okay? So your timing has to be kind of tight because of course you're doing this to don't lose any time. You don't want the acceleration of starting the run and you want to get like a tiny bit farther. But at the same time, especially with seven spells, you have this little risk of like barely completing the thing and messing things up. I recommend to practice that, get the timing down because otherwise it just doesn't save too much time but it's kind of a neat trick to know, you know. Once you get the timing, it just works. And a final note on this, there's pretty much no point on doing this at the beginning of a room, like this. Uh, like, it doesn't matter if you target or not, because you don't have any speed to storage, of course. So this trick only applies to scenarios where we do spells in like the middle of a room. And of course, some scenarios where, let's say, you do a spell and then you want to turn around after the spell. You kind of maybe don't want to do this because you're going to have speed in this direction. So if you want to go in the opposite direction, you probably don't want to do it. You have to see in which scenarios you want to do it but in general, you wanna do it when you do spells in the middle of a room, like right here. If you go from here to the door and you wanna do a spell in the middle, that's like a good place to, to do it. Yeah. So yeah, that's 
speed storage. 